fun day. Today we're going to be talking about the gold rush. My name is Mr. Weinstein. First thing you need to know, in the mid-1800s, a call echoed across the United States. There's gold in California. Prospectors and adventurers, adventurers by the thousands. flocked to California. Teachers, farmers, business people, merchants, and themselves with picks and shovels. They attacked steam beds, gravel beds, searching for shiny gold dust. Flakes and nuggets because much of this valuable mineral washed down from California's mountains, panning for gold in rivers became a common choice for prospecting people that wanted to find gold. Joseph Smith, a miner and founder of the Mormon Church in 1830 in New York State, he had visions that led him to a new Christian church. Uh, he hoped that these visions would help bring about a new society. Smith formed a community in New York, but unsympathetic neighbors disproved of the Mormon religion. In 1844, a mob in Illinois killed Smith, and Brigham Young took over as the head of it's really like, kind of like 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 oh my God. It's kind of Fine! Like you don't want to learn about Mormons and the gold rush? What about the... Let's find something more interesting for you then, huh? How about a heaven in the desert? Mormons move to Great Lakes City. Woo! Yeah, that's what I like to hear, huh? How about Utah joins the great United States? That's, that's impressive. That chapter's a scorcher. I guarantee you. How's the boot? A religious refuge in Utah. Huh? You want to learn about that? Well, I don't want to teach it. Huh? Well, I don't want to teach it. Fine. You guys all think you're smart and you sit there with your iPods and clicking your pens and doodling and what have you. What, what makes you think that I want to sit here and teach you guys? I don't. I'd rather be on the beach somewhere. No. Drinking no. milkshakes. Cold. Cold. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to say that. Oh, Kyle. Plastic. Philip. My comb. 